Welcome back to Let's Play Alan Wake 2. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'm out here in the middle of nowhere. Searching for treasure and goodies and all that. And poking around the woods, shoved my nose fairly hard into... Whoops. Into this big empty area here. No, there's just nothing. This is the dead end. Is this the one I just checked out earlier? I think it might be. Yeah, yeah. I was here. I've got a tr stump with a zero taped to it. I don't know what's up with that. I can't go down there, even with an A prompt. <laughs> Come on, any day now. There we go. This will bring me back to town. I might have to give up on this one, you guys. And I kind of hate that. Passing up in an optional objective? I mean, man! <laughs> I haven't got many ideas left, to be perfectly frank. I'm just going to head down to the trailer park to re-examine that uh, container and remind myself why I couldn't open it. Is there anything new in this other beach area here? I mean, I didn't think I would have missed anything when I came here to get that charm. Huh. Well, I guess some of the paths of dark matter disappear. Oh, no, no, there's the slime. It just... I was about to say it just isn't uh, fuzzy anymore, but no, no, it's very vague. And shimmery. Like you do. This right here, maybe. tense right now, Burning Dog fans, because I feel like I'm, well, spinning in circles, like a dog chasing his own tail. This is the second uh, fan fiction one. Reminds me of, uh... Season. 
got to stand here. Hmm. I was starting to say, it reminds me of an element I really enjoyed in Quantum Break, where you could occasionally find, uh, bits of a manuscript, like chapters of a manuscript, for lack of a better description, called, uh, Time Knife, which was an intentionally terrible, uh, screenplay by, uh, some guy who wanted to write a movie about a magic knife that controls time, except instead of just being a ripoff of Prince of Persia, it's a knife that sends you back in time when you get stabbed with it. To the precise moment that the person holding the knife wants to send you. Stop you. I almost always just use a, uh, a screenshot from the episode that, uh, well, a screenshot from the individual episodes to make the thumbnails for those episodes. But, uh... I do remember... I think there might have been two pieces to Time Knife? I don't remember. I just remember when I found those pieces, the episodes had thumbnails that were just concept art of the Dagger of Time from uh, Prince of Persia. funny. I see the Easter eggs. I don't see the lunchbox. You know what would be great is if... Okay, there wasn't actually a guy over there. What would be great is if uh, there was a, uh, a page describing Saga wandering in circles, not knowing what to do. But it only appears if you're stuck in an area for more than, you know, half an hour. Oh! More of those kids' lunch boxes. Aha! It was inside the uh, the giant coffee uh, jug. Oh, fuck! What's the word for that? Coffee pot. Coffee pot. At the front of uh, Coffee World, Justin. This one says, "You can do anything you put your mind to, hero, so long as what you put your mind to is part of the story." And a drawing of a unicorn. <laughs> uh, a. A. What the fuck? Okay, there. I couldn't pick up the manuscript fragments until I backed out of that, which is... Bizarre, actually. Uh, lunchboxes. Lunchbox found in the Coffee World parking. Another mention of the story. Whoever this is, they seem aware of Wake's horror story. Absolutely nothing added to the who left these question. Talk to someone. Find evidence. Interesting. the other one. I mean, there is the, uh, the point of interest marker on the fucking map. You know, next to the Quattori Well. I assumed that was just either a bug or... Well, something like that. Well, fuck it, I am standing right here, aren't I? Taken, I find, isn't going to have a very good day at all. Oh, yes, it's exactly in front of me. Oh, hitch. Yeah, it does that sometimes. God 
God damn it, me. Yeah, the thing should be right here. Is it just this sign? Because I've looked at this sign. The evil spirit, the Naki. No, the thing's still there. It's probably what it is. Oh, right. The ladder doesn't really exist. I was legit about to check if it was, you know, underneath in the tunnel. I know I got the thing back here. It's just... You know, when will this be enough is the question running through my mind. All right, we are across from the other thing. There's a shadow just there. Oh no, I'm being stupid. Uh... Again, the, the thing I'm looking for is previously flooded area. It has nothing to do with Can't this. Can't open this with my bare hands. No, I am going to need to uh, fix this problem. Man, I bet fucking Kratos could just pull the lock off. suddenly reminded of, uh, I can't remember what it was, just that it was, uh, Superman-themed. Oh, oh! Well, this could be interesting. Or dangerous. No, they don't want me to go that way. Okay. Oh, it's the it's the back of the save house. Okay, sure, sure. It's really confused for a second there. A lot of guys appear here, but I am holding an explosive. Well, I thought I was not descending for a microsecond there. Oh! And another lunchbox. Motherfucker. This one's quite surrounded. Who is making these? And these dream catcher things. You can overcome adversity and achieve your goals. Uh, drawing of a rain cloud, a person looking sad in the rain, and on the other side, a sun and a person standing on top of a hill with a flag. I guess that's adversity and goals, huh? That's not how that works. Oops. Do this first. Except I don't remember why we needed to go in there. Ah oh, well. Oops. Alex Casey lunchboxes. Lunchbox found in the watery lighthouse trailer park. Found all the lunch boxes hidden around watery. Nice. And this one says there were some positive affirmations inside. Cute. Not enough. You see what I mean? 
Not enough. Like, today's session has not just been me wandering around pointlessly. I have accomplished a thing, in, in at least one thing in each of the videos. Fuck, I did that again. Research that, then do this. I like how the moment it hits the ground, it starts spilling gas everywhere. Like I'm trying to justify cutters. the, uh... Trying to justify the fact that you shoot it and it blows up. Since at this point everyone's seen the Mythbusters episode, or they test that. Although, oddly enough, I think it was the James Bond episode, not the, uh... Not the video game episode, where they tested myths like, uh, whether Doom Guy could actually carry all those weapons at once. Who's ready to explode? It's right here. No, that was too far. Shite. Fortunately, I have another one. Oh, shit! Well, not standing close enough. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Dead, so I'm gonna go ahead and use the fucking first aid kit. Man, that didn't work at all. Ooh. Fucking thing caught on the hill right in front of me. What was that anyway? Rifle ammo. And it was one. One bullet. He dropped one rifle bullet. That one used to be a sheriff. Or a deputy, I guess. Since there's only one sheriff. I suppose it's possible that it's bugged. I actually googled it and I uh, saw someone suggest that it's uh, the Ranger Tower, uh, the Latte Lagoon, and the piers in the, uh, the, the trailer park and in Watery proper. I have nothing to do there. That's really, really, really good to know. Why are you turning to the side? shot that dude in the face, and it just caught it in a mask. You can't headshot these guys on the first shot. That's, uh, really good to know. Oh, how did I miss that? I think that might have been the, uh... Oh, yeah! That was the, 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 the... 
Wait. Just locked a door. Not... Hmm. Is the key around here? Is that why I haven't gotten the thing yet? Yeah, that was the, uh, the container I needed to get. Interesting. I do find it funny how every time I actually start to worry about running low on ammo, a dude drops a couple things of ammo for me. They're very good at doling that out so that you don't get to the point where you're super comfortable. You don't get to the point where you're fucking terrified every time you pull the trigger, either. Is this the one? Ye no, it's the one next door. Must be locked from the other side. Oh, well, fuck that. Uh, that's not going to work. Oh. Must have killed a dude there. Not going to say no. Is it the bolt cutter? Should I be able to have the bolt cutters at this point? Never did use this. Huh. No, you know, you can't just use the clicker on that. I suppose if I understand the metaphor, it would be a bit overkill anyway. Sorry, you know, it's just now occurred to me I could just throw myself over this fucking fence from this position. Huh. I mean, I might catch myself on the fence and it would hurt, but, you know, we could scramble over. It's just made of wood. It's not, like, fucking barbed wire. Bots. I just both shot a canister I could barely see because of brushes, and then dodged a uh, axe coming in from completely off screen, and I feel pretty proud of that. Actually, since I thought I got all the dudes already. As I said, almost out of batteries, here's a guy dropping several of them. Oh well. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I guess I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play uh, Alan Wake 2. I might have to... When I might have to give up on this uh, quest. It kills me to admit that. Take care of yourselves, Burning Dog fans. And... Well, that's weird. They don't usually reclose themselves and put new items inside. <laughs> Take care of yourselves, and stay in the light.